Well, it has been a long time since I tested my Sony DVD player on my Wani portable DVD player. And yep, the last time I tested my Sony DVD player, it was at my dad's house with the Roku TV. So yeah. So anyways, here are the six DVDs we'll be testing out. Rise of the Guardians. Spongebob Season 1. For especially for Blake the Spongebob fan. Freebirds. Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs 2. Or should I say Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs? Da. A Bug's Life. And the Super Mario Bros. movie because I love the Super Mario franchise. So yeah. So anyways, here's Rise of the Guardians, which has the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo. I don't know why the disc is boring gray, but who cares? So anyways, here's the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo. But on the Sony DVD player from the Wani Portable DVD player. And by the way, just letting you know, these five DVDs were featured in Blake's latest testing video, testing my Sony Blu-ray player on my Samsung TV. I pretty hope I should get a Sony Blu-ray player soon like him. Maybe one day. Okay, that was the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo, but on the Sony DVD player from the Wani Portable DVD player. Next DVD is SpongeBob Season 1, which has the Paramount DVD logo, and it also has the Nickelodeon Fish 2. I'm going to choose Disc 1. I might plan to get a new copy because this... Disc one's kind of cracked, but the disc seems to be a little fine, maybe a bit dirty. But anyways, here's the Nickelodeon Fish and the Paramount DVD logos with options variant. Yeah, it's the options variant. So anyways, here are the logos, but recorded from my Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. Okay, that was the Nickelodeon Fish and Paramount DVD logos, but on the Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. So now next DVD is Freebirds, which has the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo, and my copy shows it, unlike Blake's copy. So anyways, here is the Sony... The, no! 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment. I almost said Sony Pictures Home Entertainment. I'm at 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment. So anyways, here's the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo, but on my Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. Okay, that was the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo but on my Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. Now, next DVD is Cloudy with the Chance of Meatballs 2. Or should I say Cloudy with the Chance of Meatballs? Da! <laughs> DVD collection in nutshell reference. And it does have the Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo on there. 
I don't know why the disc is transparent, but who cares? So anyways, here's the Sony Pictures from our entertainment logo, but on my Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. I'll move it up closer for you guys so you actually can see. I if my camera's a bit shaky. Because holding with one hand is just not going to be enough. Or should I say, not going to hold much longer. So anyways, that was the Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo. But on the Sony DVD player from my Wani Portable DVD player. Next DVD is A Bug's Life, 2003 DVD, and it does have the THX Tax logo. So anyways, here's the THX Tax logo, but on the Sony DVD player from the Wani Portable DVD player. And I am going to skip this part with the warning screens because it's just, just going to take too much time, so I'll be right back. Okay, we are at the menu now. So anyways, let's play. Here's the THX text logo. The audience is listening. Well, that's it for the THX text logo, but on the Sony DVD player from the Wani portable DVD player. Last but not least is the Super Mario Bros. movie, which is the Power Up Edition. It does have the Universal logo, and the reason why I picked this is because I love the Super Mario franchise, and my number one favorite character is Princess Peach because she's just so beautiful. So anyways, yeah, it does have the Universal logo, and it has Toad saying, Do not touch that mushroom, you die! And Bowser saying, I finally found it, and now no one can stop me. And also, the Mario Plumbing commercial where Mario and Luigi say, Mamma Mia! <laughs> But anyways, here's the Universal logo, and I might have to turn down the volume due to copyright reasons. So I'll turn down the volume to 11, so I don't resist getting copyrighted by the Universal logo. Well, guys, that is pretty much it with the testing video. So anyways, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video of testing out my DVDs on the Sony DVD player from my Wani portable DVD player. So anyways, if you have enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe. So anyways, peace out.